it's Caitlin. Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a tech haul because I've been buying some stuff and I like talking about tech and any excuse that I get to talk about tech, I'm going to take it. The first thing I just want to say is I hope my audio sounds all right. I recorded my last video with my lapel mic for the first time and there was a slight buzzing because my ring light gives off some kind of frequency so I just hope that's okay and I have it clipped on my shirt so hopefully it sounds okay these are all things that I've gotten plus a little bit more we're gonna go through this today yeah I hope you guys enjoy this video if you do make sure to give it a big thumbs up because it helps me out a lot and make sure to subscribe if you would like to see more content from me or you would just like to see more of my face for whatever reason. And of course, let me know in the comments any new tech that you've gotten recently, whether it's the new graphics card or the new consoles. Let me know, let's talk about it. So I'm going to start with the biggest thing. Also, I made another really big purchase that's not tech related. This is a hint right here. I will be making a video about that soon. If you follow me on Instagram, you know what it is. That's coming soon. The first thing that I got is a new phone. I got the Samsung Galaxy S20 Plus. As you guys know, I was a diehard fan for my Pixel 3 XL that I had for two years. And everyone was like, why didn't you get the Pixel 4 when it came out? And I just wasn't really excited about it. It didn't seem worth it to me. And I waited for the Pixel 5. I really wanted this phone, but I was like, I'm just gonna wait for the Pixel 5. So the Pixel 5 also disappointed me, and I was like, you know what, like my phone is starting to show its age. I'm just gonna go get this. So I got the Aura Blue S20 Plus. Um, it is such a beautiful, beautiful color. I've been using this phone for a little over a month now, between a month and two months and I'm in love with it. I really love it. I got the unlocked one from Best Buy. It's a Best Buy exclusive color, so I had to get it from Best Buy. The 120 hertz refresh rate on the screen, the whole shape of the phone, the whole look of the phone, the whole, everything about it is so nice, especially the refresh rate. I love it so much. I used to be really against Samsung phones because I had a lot of them for a really long time and I was, I really did not like them. But I think that in the past like three or so years, they've really, really stepped it up. And I'm really, really happy with this phone. So I'm glad that I had to wait a while to make this video because I can like fully explain my love for this phone because I've been using it so much. Very happy with this. So staying on the theme of Samsung, I picked up the Samsung Galaxy Watch Active. I had been wanting a smartwatch for a really long time. I was familiar with the Samsung ones because my boyfriend has one and everything, but I just wasn't into the whole like big watch face with like, that looks like a real watch. I wanted something that looked like a smartwatch and I also didn't want to pay like $400. So I'm wearing it right now because I am I got ready for work and I'm just recording this before work. Yeah, so this has been so amazing for me now that I have a real job and I've been working and going out and everything. I didn't get the two because I don't need LTE or anything. I always have my phone on me. And this one, I was able to get it for $150 with all of my discounts and stuff at work. I've been using this for a while now too. And it's just so amazing. Like, I love everything about it. I think it's the perfect size for my tiny little wrist. I really love the band that it comes with. I love how customizable it is and everything. I mean, you guys know what smartwatches are, but I'm really happy that I went with this one specifically. Being able to text like on my watch, just it has so many features that are so helpful and having cute little themes is fun. Next I wanna talk about phone cases cause I completely forgot about that. I have three here. I did order another one cause I'm just a phone case lover. I'm just one of those people. I do have another one coming in the mail but I will show it on the screen. That's the one I'm most excited about and I was gonna order it the day I got my phone but it was unavailable for a really, really long time and that's the Case Defy like Halloween collection one and it's like got glittery bats on it. And I just think that's gonna look so beautiful on this phone especially with the color like it's gonna look like they're flying in the night sky. The first one that I got was this Samsung LED cover. This one's really cool. I only got it because 
It was so cheap and so cool. It was on sale for like 20 bucks or $10 or 12. This one basically uses the wireless power share feature to like twinkle when you put the phone upside down. And it does have some other really cool features where you can do like a countdown with the camera and just like stuff like that. So that's really cool and I do love it. But I really wanted a plain clear case. So I picked up the Casemate tough clear case. Now I'm so picky about clear cases. Like I, there's a million things about them that I don't like. And this was the best one that I could find. I really do like this one. I was using it for a while. The last one that I got is the Incipio. I think that's how you say it. Um, Elan, Elon, I don't know. Elon Musk, I don't know. But it is just this case that was on clearance at Walmart for $2. So I just got it. But this one looks really pretty on my phone. I actually really like this for $2. It's a really great case and it has a really nice feel to it and it seems pretty protective. So I picked that up. And then lastly for Samsung accessories, I got a new case for my Galaxy Buds and it's like a Galaxy. So I just really like this. I had another one on there if you've seen it in my other videos, but the little like this part broke. And I like that this one has its own little hinge. So if it's on your bag and it like hits, it won't just like swing open and they will fall out. So but yeah, this was really cheap on Amazon and it matches my Nintendo Switch, my water bottle, my everything. Like I have so many things with this print on it. So I figured that was perfect. Next thing that I have here is just, this is, it, I don't know why I kept the box. Um, I got these gradient keycaps. They are like a blue ombre. They are so beautiful. I love them so much. They were pretty cheap. I think they're about $12. So they're not the greatest quality, but they are good. And I got them off Amazon and they come in other colors. And I just thought it would look really good on my new keyboard, which we're gonna talk about next. So the last thing that I picked up for my computer, it's not a game, is the Razer Huntsman Tournament Edition TKL keyboard. I have a 60% keyboard, which I was using for a while because SteelSeries sent me their Apex M70, I think it was called, and I love that keyboard. Like, if you watch my old setup videos, you know that, like, I love that keyboard with my whole heart, but it was just so big and I didn't use the number pad, so I got a 60% and I got a RK61, and I love that keyboard so much. I still use it all the time and I switch between them. But with Final Fantasy and stuff, I wanted to get a TKL because that's just like the most practical for me. And I do use my 60% on my iPad to type notes all the time. So I still use it and everything, but I really wanted this keyboard because I love the way it looks. It's got a braided Type-C cable, which is really nice. And this has Razer's new Optimechanical Red switches. And oh my gosh. The actuation point on this switch is so amazing that it blows my mind. I literally mistype all the time because of the responsiveness, but it's really amazing and they feel really great. I really love this keyboard. Speaking of that, actually, I do have more keycaps sent some keycaps by my sponsor color controllers if you guys remember my two custom controllers that i got from them way back in the day they were kind enough to send me some keycaps because they make keycaps now and i was so excited about them if you're watching this thank you so much i love these to death so i have these little asteroid ones a little ufo I have an animal crossing one these ones they are selling right now so Go check that out, link in description. So I've been loving those keycaps. Love artisan keycaps so much. They make me so happy. So I also picked up Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I was a little worried about it because I saw not so great reviews, but I love everything Viking related and just like, I love anything like that. I'm not a huge Assassin's Creed fan, so I wasn't going into it like, I know a lot of people, you know, dislike things about it because they're huge Assassin's Creed fans but I'm not so like you know what I'm trying to say I didn't know what to expect really I played Brotherhood when I was really young and I don't remember it and I played a little bit of Odyssey 
and I couldn't really get into that one. But yeah, I really am enjoying it. I'm not very far into it because I've been working a lot, but I'm really loving it. I really love the gameplay. It reminds me a lot of like The Witcher 3 and like Rise of the Tomb Raider. So I'm so down for that. I love it. And the last thing that I picked up is the camera lens that I am using right now. I had a Canon 50mm 1.8 that I've been using for a while, but I love that lens. It's my favorite lens that I have, but my camera sensor adds like a 1.5 times crop factor to it. So it's like really impractical for me for like YouTube videos and stuff. It's great for photo shoots and whatnot, but a lot of things like, so I picked up Canon 24 millimeter uh, 2.8 lens because that eliminates the crop factor and it's just so much better for like macros and videos like this because my camera is literally right here like it it's so much better for a lot of things so I was really excited to pick that up and I had a credit from my phone so I got it for two dollars so that was really awesome and yeah that's all the tech that I have purchased in the past two months or so again let me know in the comments what you have gotten recently I just keep looking at this on the in the corner and I'm like wait till y'all see that. That's all for today. Hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you in the next video. I love you so much. Bye.